Good morning. Good morning. It is, this is 60 Seconds to Serenity with me, Greg Hammond, on Tuesday, November 28th, 2017. It's bright and early in the morning, and I'm here to help you remember that you have the tools within yourself to respond to your day. And in just 60 seconds, you can shift the way that you're feeling, you can shift your vibration. The 60 seconds to serenity tool, that's every morning having a reminder, shift your day. Because your awareness comes up. Your awareness comes up each time you watch this video. Every day that you commit to yourself, whatever time it is when you jump on here. Good morning. Good morning, Carol. I see lots of people hopping on here from all over. I love it. I love it around the globe. Everybody's jumping on. So these tools raise your vibration. Each time that you repeat, getting on the video, wherever you are in the world, whatever time you get on, whether you're, whether you're able to join live or whether you just watch this when you have time, when it fits in. If you commit to yourself to be able to watch the video and to focus, to think about, to take in the information here. Allow it to come into your mind and settle in there and the repetition of doing that every day helps you be able to respond to things in your day. And responding means that you're relaxed as opposed to reacting, which is a, a quick uh, quicker and less focused way to deal with the things that happen in your day. Um, if you're returning to work and um, you have things to deal with, maybe it's coworkers, maybe it's situations, uh, you're responding to those situations is your choice to respond. as opposed to reacting. So respond with your 60 seconds to serenity throughout the day. Respond to the fact that you have awareness that your choice is to respond and respond with your 60 seconds to serenity tool. 60 seconds to serenity. I have in my hand a very cool cold feeling, cool to the touch and very cool in its shape and texture, rough on this side, it's smooth on this side. Place that in my hands and I get, when I hold this I get uh, a physical reminder, yes I can respond to situations in my day. And you want to use your 60 seconds to serenity tools of the breathing, nice slow breath nice slow breath here in out the main point being that it's slow and serene and as you do that you feel a calmness coming over your mind by doing this bring yourself into state of mind you bring yourself into alpha and in meditation, you can do this. Yoga will do this. Music can do this for you, bring you into an alpha state of mind, which is a little bit slower, calmer state of mind. And that's what you want, is you want your mind to be calm and ready to respond instead of reacting. And you use positive affirmations as you're doing your breathing. You use Nice positive statements like, I am healthy, I am happy, I am healthy. I live in paradise. No matter where you are, there is some part of it that you can recognize as paradise. Um, and I say that because some people think paradise is only Hawaii or only 
Montana or only the Florida Keys or only a villa in Cuba or only the Caribbean or only the coast of Mexico or only in the mountains of Peru. Everywhere that you go can be paradise because of the way that you use your 60 seconds to serenity tool and the way that you use your response choice, your choice to respond and affirmation. So paradise can be anywhere. I also put my memory is very good because it's an empowering statement. I always remember everything I need to remember. I always remember where I put things. I'm always on time or just a little bit early. Everything works out in my favor. Now these sound, um, if you've not said them, if you've not used affirmations and statements like that, it sounds, it might sound interesting or a little absurd, but it's very important very powerful and if you notice how uncomfortable that feels if you feel that it's uncomfortable and you know you're noticing that because your awareness is coming up you're building your awareness that's all the way through this these uh, videos little by little I'm adding in stuff to boost your awareness because if you're aware of how you think and how you go about your day that tool is one of your biggest assets to pay attention and see what's going through your mind and how you react and how you can shift that to a response. If it feels uncomfortable, it may be similar. It, it, may, it will show you, oh, I don't do this very often. And you'll notice that a lot of people don't walk around doing that. They, they've been trained by television and by their, their surroundings, the people in their environment, to do the opposite. Write out your list, 10 things you're grateful for. I do mine on a, in a notebook, right? You can do yours in a notebook where you have 10 lines and think about those things and why you're grateful for them. Um, at least begin that exercise. If, you, if 10 things seems like a lot, do three and just work on doing three. And then all the way through, as we come into the month of December, we go all the way through the end of the year we are going to continue to build and if three things is what you can put on your gratitude list put those three things on there and if it has to be the same thing every day so that you have done it then do that if you can add more and if you can change and have something different then, then definitely do that you want to fill up the gratitude list and work towards getting toward up to ten I'm gonna play the chimes because a little bit of sound is very helpful. Music, your favorite song, that's what you want to team up with your 60 seconds to serenity, calmness, breath, right? Because calmness is a superpower. And you can respond to things. And I have shown the, the parking ticket. Uh, this was one that I got recently. Hooray! Congratulations to me for getting a parking ticket because it means that all kinds of things that I had not expected will happen. Good things happen if I'm re responding to my uh, environment and what's going on with a positive way. I will, I will create more of that. Today I have to hop off quickly because I'm going to be uh, doing my reading, but I wanted to make sure that I covered the, the focus of the calm, serene breath your affirmations, writing down your affirmations, remembering to respond, wait five minutes before you respond, wait about five seconds before you respond to somebody. Five minutes might be a little bit long, but sometimes five minutes might be very small compared to waiting an entire day to respond to somebody for something about something important. If you feel like you need to think of it, that's a powerful thing to do because you are responding and trust this process. Right? Write out the top six things you need to get done for your day and get them done. Check them off the list. Just six things and get those six things done and don't stop until you do. If you are looking, oh yeah, remember, uh, keep smiling through your day. It's a powerful thing. It's always nice if you see somebody in passing, um, 
just it may, it, somebody you've never seen before smile to them in the car on public transportation smile and and nod and acknowledge them with a smile uh, if you'd like a magnet or a sticker for global jam for peace uh, message me your your address you'd like that mailed to and I will do that remember the good news your life just got a whole lot easier because you're tuning into 60 seconds to serenity with me Greg Hammond and you want to be the change that you want to see in the world by improving yourself so using these tools to respond to your environment means that you are becoming better yourself which means you're helping the entire world and we will be talking about setting goals and writing a goal card that you can keep in your pocket so that you see this all the time so that you can achieve your goals I have to hop off because uh, my morning is moving right along happy Tuesday to you peace love music I will see you tomorrow morning I'll be on between 6 and 7 feel free to share this with anybody these powerful tools of 60 seconds of serenity and let tell them to go to the uh, uh, other videos on my timeline and see all that have been posted for well over a month I'm taking you through the end of the year right the, the 60 day uh, journey to the end of the month with 60 seconds to serenity and then we'll go on from there of course but I, I want to help you get to the end of this year and close it out in a beautiful way and I want you to be able to go into the next year very empowered that's my goal and uh, so I'm gonna help you do it right so put that in your mind too that, that we are on this journey together and leave me a message and let me know if uh, you came up with an affirmation or you have an, uh, something about these videos that has helped you please let me know because it's helpful to to see those and to be able to reflect back. Peace, love, music. I'll see you tomorrow.